All right, so I'm doing interviews here at the JCP party, and I have Paul Krill here, who's a journalist for InfoWorld. Um, so tell me a little bit about what you've been doing with your articles recently on Java topics. A bunch about Java 8. That was the Java SE 8. I wrote a bunch about that. I wrote about Java FX. I wrote about Project Panama the other day. Uh, what's that? I have, I, I'm a Java guy, and I've even heard of that. Uh, provides access to native libraries from Java code. Apparently there's going to be some, they're gathering votes for it. I think it's going to be, uh, they're going to tally up the votes tomorrow, I think. Wow. But it was, I think it was first floated in March on the Open JDK uh, mailing list. And now they've just been getting a lot of support for it. Yeah, I wrote an article on it today. We could cool. probably go on there and give you, tell you more than, what, more than, more than what I can recall off the top of my head, so. All right, so since this is the, um, same, same question I asked the previous lady. It's, it's 2014, 15th year anniversary. What were you doing in 1999? 1999? Yeah. I was still, I was at InfoWorld then. I, was, <laughs> I, I just got married. I mean, I did a lot of stuff, a lot of changes in those wow. days. So, didn't have were were you still covering Java topics back then? I guess I probably was, yeah, yeah. So, so it's like 15 years of Off and on for probably Info 20 World years, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. So I've been there for 19 years, so. That's awesome. So any, any articles that come to mind in the past 15 years where you got a really good reaction or positive or negative that you think is worth talking about? There's, there's so many of them. I wrote some about... <laughs> Java SE8, that's the one that just came out, right? Yeah, SE8. Yep. Yeah. I got a, I got a lot of reactions on an article that came out in March, on, in March on the day of the introduction, that talked about lambdas and that sort of thing. So it's a lot of reaction on that. So, but since I don't have the uh, website in front of me and can't pull up the comments, I can't recall it specifically. But and then yeah, I wrote one about Java. Yeah, people were passionate yeah, about Java yeah. 8. Yeah, I wrote about. I, and then, like I said, a few weeks later, I wrote about Java FX. And somebody in, in Russia didn't like the article. So, but <laughs> people like the article; they don't say anything. If they don't like it, they're sure they're sure to say something. So yeah. So the JavaFX community is still very active and very vocal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But well, you're not supposed to talk to me. But is it? Do you think JavaFX can can hold up against HTML5 and all the other web development technologies that are out there? I I think it has its place. I mean, it's not going to displace HTML5, but it definitely solves a solves a real problem in a very elegant way. Which what real problem is? I mean, it's, grab it's the best cross-platform desktop UI framework out there. I mean, what what are you going to use? Flash? It only <laughs> runs on Java, though, doesn't it? I mean, you can package as native applications and cross-deploy using the deployment tool. So, for native desktop deployment, I mean, it's really the best framework out there now. Okay, how many people are using it? How many developers are using it? Um, surprisingly, I've get, got a lot more interest over the past couple of years as Swing and legacy developers are coming up to speed on it. And um, I think even if you check Google Trends, it's been rising in popularity, which is odd, since you would think it would be the opposite. Really? Is so, it, yeah, I mean, I it, think your reaction at the article is not just a quirk. Like, there's a lot of people out there using it on real industrial projects. Is, isn't Swing being phased out? It's not being worked on, and it hasn't been worked on for a while, so. <laughs> it's a spec, though. It's part of the JCP spec. What can you tell me about the future of JavaFX, or probably nothing, right? Yeah, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> you, you know the game is played. <laughs> cool. That's, that's no, me, thanks, thanks for being a sport and coming on the JCP okay. 15th anniversary interview. So you okay, can't, don't get to leave without prizes. So would you like a book? I guess, sure. sure. OK, so we have the 15th. Hello World book, and you also get a night hacking laptop sticker. Okay, that's great. Okay, yeah, this is something I can. Yeah. I can take, I guess. All right. I'll probably end up bringing it to uh, work for everybody else to look at it. All right, great. You want your uh, <laughs> cool. phone here? Thanks very much, yeah, Paul. Yeah, sure.